we're here on the set with uh, Mr. Dupree. Dupree, he plays the limousine driver. Mr. Dupree, tell the people how you found out about the project and sacrifice. I heard about the um, the project through uh, a um, producer, Masu, who's the line producer on the video that I did, and um, you actually did some of the shots on that video, so that's how I kind of really heard about it. Yeah. And um, you thought I would make a good uh, character in the movie A Sacrifice. I did some scene work before um, on some films back in the day, and. Uh, so that's how I wound up on the set. Then I found out that I have to shave. So uh, this is about to come off for the, for the movie. But I wanted to hold on to it until the last minute. I'm about to go in and shave it right now for the movie. But only for you, Gwenshaw, only for you. Uh, uh, how long have you been acting? Oh, I guess about, I don't want to say, because that's going to give away how old I am, man. I'm just not going to say what, because I've done uh, a couple of features, um, films, I've been an extra in several. I did one with Denzel, uh, I've been in one with Stallone. Um, for, for many years, I'll, I'll say, I've been acting for many years. Outside of acting, what is it that you, uh, what else do you do? Oh, a little bit of everything. <laughs> Let me think about it. <laughs> Oh, that's a good question. Um, well, what other business are you into? Oh, I'm into real estate. I do real estate. I, um, I'm also an artist. I paint. I do oil paintings. Um, I like to consider myself a renaissance man, all around, all around guy. It's, that's always a hard question for me to answer. People ask me that a lot, like, what do you do? And usually a lot of times I, I, I hesitate on the answer because I really do whatever I want to do most of the time. And that's just the truth. I do what I want to do, and I've been blessed enough to be able to. How was the experience working with Apex Films LLC and Crenshaw Heights Productions, and were they professional? It was a very, very good experience. In fact, um, it was the first time I got to actually participate in um, some of the production, meaning I did some of the sound. I, Crenshaw let me do some of the sound, so I was a sound man for part of it, and I got to say, cut a couple of times or you know quiet on the set you know get ready roll them action you know so that was that was like a highlight a highlight for me you know being able to actually um look behind the camera a little bit instead of just being in front of it all the time so that was that was that was really uh i appreciate that that was really a high, high point i saw some of the cuts of uh a sacrifice actually i had a chance to see some things before um before anyone else um, did because I did some voiceovers and uh, I liked the way it cut. I liked the way it cut, and uh, of course I was trying to build in another part for myself. I was trying to build in the sequel, and so because uh, since did. Yeah. yeah, since Vinny has a problem, um, I hope to one day be the next mob boss. You know, so I'm uh, you know always trying to angle for for um, you know for more of uh, more scenes, I should say which is something that actors uh, do. You know, when we get on set, we start ad-libbing because we're trying to get more, more scenes. And Quinshaw was really cool with that. Some directors are like, stick to the script, you know? <laughs> Don't ad-lib. But, um, you know. All right, I'm really looking forward to the premiere. Um, I, actually, I have a lot more at stake than just being an, an actor in it. I did a clothing line, which is Pump Apparel, so you'll see some of that in the film. And so, you know, I have more of a stake in it than just being the actor on this side. I really have a stake in it um, being a success. And I hope everyone comes out and enjoys the film and enjoys what Crenshaw uh, was able to do and how he was able to, to cut it. Because a lot of this is in the cutting. It's a lot of it is, you know, you, don't, you can't really know what it's going to look like until the artist behind the camera does his work. And so, you know, hopefully it'll, everyone will, will think, you know, it was a good project and everyone will like what they see. Big shout out to Apex Films, LLC, all the cast, all the crew. A Sacrifice, come out and see it. See you at the premiere.